and first I connect the battery terminals negative to black cable on the charger on the battery charger I wanted to see how is the voltage now before I plug in the the charger so 12.35 is pretty pretty not not good <laughs> it's not great it should be more than 12.6 I believe so now you will see what happens when I plug in the charger the charger will start to in enter it will send voltage a higher voltage into the battery to charge it a good battery will charge not too fast this is an indicator of a bad battery if you see this going up within half hour that is full and it says float then the battery is sulfated or however it's called it means it will not take a charge there are desulfating chargers uh, but i don't have one i i think i might try one at some point but when the battery is bad it's usually after four or five years and i will just replace it for this one i'm trying to recharge it so now it's full it was i was away for some time so i didn't really check how long it took but now it says full also it says it's automatic this charger switches between uh, 12 volts and 6 volts and now it's time to take it to the car remote is not gonna work because there's no battery voltage looks much better now after charging it and the battery could be okay and I'll show you what to check if the battery is really okay you will see that in a moment when I try to start the car that's when it really shows and I have another video for that also yeah, try to avoid these sparkles there because a battery that is not good anymore